If you're thinking about picking up a new hobby in this new year, maybe next year it'll end up as a career. Hear me out. A stressed out social worker turned her love for pottery and outlet for self-care into a full-time job. Now she's offering classes to the public. Tierra Newbaum is live in North Austin with the story. Good morning, Tierra. Such an incredible story. Isn't this amazing, Leslie? I love that Tina didn't wait any longer. You're like, if not when, if not now, then when uh, <laughs> to uh, start your pottery career. And uh, can you tell us a little bit about your story and when you were like, you know what, I'm just going to start doing this? Well, um, so I started the business about seven years ago. Um, I was taking pottery classes here in Austin with um, a local legend. His name is uh, John Vela. And he became a friend and a mentor for me over the years and really helped support my business. And so that's how I started it. It's called Brave Ceramics because I was a little nervous to start a business by myself. And so it's kind of a reminder to uh, be brave, be creative, and kind of get out there. And now you have a, a pottery line of some different dinnerware, and you're teaching classes. Yeah. You're at different uh, markets around town. So what are some of these upcoming classes that you've got going on? Well, I kind of have a, a range of classes. I've got pottery wheel classes. Those are really popular. Everyone wants to try the wheel. Um, I do those monthly. And then I have fun classes like these where we're going to be applying silkscreen designs onto surfaces. Um, we've got sake cup classes at Yoroko. Um, I also do mug making classes. Um, those are at Parker and Scott. So Love all of we've these got, places. Yeah, lots of options for people depending on their level of uh, creativity and so <laughs> so many great local spots and uh, supporting local with you as well okay what do we need to do to make our little sake cups this morning okay so what we're going to be doing today is applying a um, outside surface design to our cups okay. so we've got pre-made uh, silk screens we're applying ink or glaze onto the side and then we're going to be using our uh, squeegee to literally drag the ink and pushing it through the design so what we're doing is we're printing on what's called a jelly plate. It is a kind of flexible uh, surface that allows us to apply it to the curved outside surface of the cups or mugs, bases, things like that. How am I doing here? Because I kind of just this, made that yep, up. Is that no, correct? This is great. Okay, cool. Yep. <laughs> You're dragging it through. Yep. Downward pressure. That looks great. And then let's do one more squeegee uh, left to right. Okay. It's just right now? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Okay, and then we're getting to the fun part. This is the big reveal. Love it. So you're going to peel away your screen design, and we're going to see what happened below. Ooh, gorgeous. Oh, I love oh, that. I like the two-tone that you've got over there, oh, too. Oh, yeah. Okay, now. Okay, this is the fun part. So we've got our cup. So what we're going to do is we're going to apply downward pressure onto the plate, and then we're going to roll our design over, and it's going to transfer. Can I just go for yeah, it? Yeah, go for it. Yep, downward Ooh. pressure. Rolling, rolling, keep going, keep going, keep going. Oh my gosh, that's gorgeous. Woo! Beautiful. Okay, yeah. and then now what do I do about this blank side? Okay, so now we're going to uh, clean the screen and we're going to do, it, do again, it again, apply okay. more. I'm going to pass you this. We're going to oh use that gosh. to kind of clean it. Oh, that that didn't take too, too much. So people I, are nervous about pottery. They can really, do this one. Exactly, and that's kind of my goal is I want it to be accessible to people because for me, you know, if you're not being creative in your job every day, sometimes it can be stressful to try something new. And so my goal is to create it in a kind of easy fashion. So well, with that being said, we are going to hop on the wheel here in just a yes, little bit, we are. which I'm excited <laughs> about. Um, but Leslie, you can go to braveceramics.com for details on the, uh oh, I got crooked. Is that okay? That's okay. Okay. Yep. Um, braveceramics.com for details and uh, look at some of the different classics classes that Tina has to offer um, follow along with her on social media to see what markets she's going to be at and uh, so fun okay should I finish right, her so up? this is the fun part so you're going to come right here kind of line it up uh, and then you won't um, apply too much pressure because there's not too much of a blank space keep going there we go Done. A beauty. Beautiful. Look at that. In three minutes on live TV. Okay, Leslie, we'll check back in in just a bit. I will hop on the wheel. <laughs> All right, that looks lovely. I, I see this as the start of the Tierra New Bomb ceramics brand. Let me know. I'll buy your plates. Hey, <laughs> I am in. Okay, girl, stay tuned. <laughs> All right, thanks, Tierra. We'll check back in for sure.